What's up guys? Thought I'd do a quick video on the Volvo that I drive at work, the semi-truck. Um, it is a little messy in here. I've been kind of living in here the last couple days and whatnot, but it's a 2019, even though it's only 2018. And uh, I said I'd give you a little, um, you know, quick, this is how you lock the door, how you open the door, little compartment down there for gloves or whatever, speaker. There's actually accent lighting on the other side over there at your feet light switch dimmer uh, hazards your work light key obviously these are just dummy switches they don't work your steering wheel here has got all kinds of stuff on it you know you get your cruise control your menu you use this little guy right here and you can uh, adjust your your idle right there um, for your cruise control, you know, flash your lights or whatever, answer phone, hang out phone, mute phone. And then on this side, you've got even more, and you got another one. You can skip track, uh, you know, skip track, go back track. And then right here, you hit this button, and it changes uh, FM or whatever it is you're listening to. I usually just keep it on Bluetooth audio because I got Pandora. And then this button right here, and then you can use this to scroll. And then you go like this, and there's another one, which is not giving me the options right now because it's running. You go like this, it goes back to home. And you can go through here and check out all your stats on your truck, what it's doing, or just do your home screen. I like to see what my load gauge is constantly, and this gives me my eco for best uh, fuel mileage, which I'm not crazy worried about, but I'm, I just like to find out. Uh, mile per hour and all that good stuff and then you've got your normal gauges you got your wussy horn here and your big truck horn here and then you've got your windshield wipers right here you can pull it down turn them on you know down once is intermittent and you can adjust it right here or you can go down again and it's faster go down again and it's all the way on or if you just want to wipe the windshield you go like that once it does it once and then if you want to wash it, you pull it up. And, you know, the thing does its thing like always. And then here you've got, oh, how about here? right here, cruise control. So all the way up is off. One down is auto. One, two, three for increase. And then if you hit this button at the end right there, when you're going down a hill, it'll automatically just crank your RPMs up and jake you as hard as it can. We've got our inner lockers and whatnot. You've got your mud and snow, basically just traction control, your fifth wheel slide, uh, downhill or uphill assist so that you don't roll backwards when you take off. This is an automatic. Um, your airbag up and down, your, you know, I got my drop axle, my tag axle, and then right now I have my PTO running. Comes with a nice Volvo stereo that is uh, Bluetooth capable. And then I've got my heater. You got your Johnson bar, whatever you want to call it some power outlets down there. I also have a USB port up here and another power outlet right there. And then right here, sorry about the mess guys, I am in North Dakota, it's a mess down here. You have neutral, drive, and then this is manual where you can select your gear back and forth here. You can always select a gear while you're driving up and down, but then if you hit this right here and push it all the way forward, it's fold so you can get by. This is economy and power right there. So uh, real quick, that's it. Not too bad, I gotta say. I don't like automatics and I don't like Volvos, but um, I'll take a new truck. I mean, it still has the fucking plastic on the seat. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll get you another video later with the outside.